I like three Aegis' draft overall. Uh, I think they have everything they need. It's a complete lineup. Thompson. Okay. Thompson? Taking a lot of damage here, actually. Chessie with the body blocks. Active strike. What a play by Chessie. Last it and get CS. But he's not really uh, doing that. Gerax. See you later, buddy. Is going to go down here. And good strikes. Finds Gerax is uh, a little bit of a pickle here. Stuck between a rock and a hard place. Moving the avalanche will be there. They got the tree to toss across if they need it, but they'll just club him in the face of it instead. You're really happy if your axe is farming that dagger because you already have the tiny with the dagger and he might actually go bottom now. Oh yeah, Horde's gonna come in. Jarex has been found and surrounded. He will be going down. But on tap will go across the spec, but they can't find more. Than I'm not sure if that's enough. This and might be though. Bane as well. The avalanche toss is gonna be there. He got a little bit greedy. Like, I I'm surprised you didn't play more. Oh, uh, Jaker in trouble and dead. Yeah, it's very easy for Thompson to farm with this build. Uh, back there in trouble. Fiend's grip comes out with a life drain as well. He's definitely gone. Firestorm just a bonus on top. Life is moving in. Has to win his curse again. Jarex is waiting though. Fisher can come out when his curse has been used. Not enough damage though. Oh, Echo Slam as well. Slow down Chessy. The tool jumping in. Arrow. Boogie hit by the arrow. A little bit of trouble. Can't be waking enough. But now the damage at the one first. Unlock will go down afterwards. It's going to be a buyback coming out. In the meantime, Wyvern will fall and Bane goes down on the back foot as well as Marana finds the pickoff. But Toomba Man is in this though. Yeah, yeah that, he's moving that, that in. That could be huge for them. Mm -hmm. Oh, Moonlight Shadow has been used. Axe walks in. The Rue's going to reveal him. Gets the call out on the two, but he's taking way too much damage for the fast one. He needs to be way quicker, but he can't. He's going to go down. Feature to cut off. That's true. The good news is, well, other than the death of Pugna, the DD on Chessy is good enough. Nightmare's going to come out. They TP Thompson in. Fiend's Grip There's been used, they'll turn around, and so Tiny cool. should be going down, but no, the stats resistance doesn't make the Fiend's Grip last long, but it's long enough. Mm. So they still don't know about it, which means he Mirana could is, reveal. They are pinging her out, she might walk into the center. She yeah, did. Echo Slam comes oh. down, Fish is going to be there, he's got the here. enchant totem. No. Another sentry goes down, and goodbye, Marana. Oh, jump in by Chessie, Avalanche Toss going to be the horn as well. Boogie getting low, we'll go for Dark Rift out, needs to root them and escape, Thanks. but he can't. He's going to go down, call on the back foot. We'll catch more. When his curse comes out, Matumaman taking a lot of damage from the Morphling. Garrick's trying to stop this with a fissure, but he can't. Nightmare saved the last one on Matumaman, but he caves his skull in with the axe. Thompson. Thompson's too strong for this. Or is he? Avalanche toss comes in. They get nope. him. He had way too much agi and not enough health. Boogie is charging. He's leading the way. Chessy and Axe are oh, actually... They just broke the smoke. Fish is going to come through on the two. The horn's been used, but no. They're already locked down and held Axe in place. Life friend's going to be there. Now Avalanche coming out. But Tumor Man, is he on this dust prop? He's going to be fine. Nightmare onto Tiny, so they can move away. On the other side, though, Jarex is going to fall next to the creepway. The buybacks come out on both sides, but the Axe and Shaker are back in this. The Echo Slam's still available. Boogie needs to be careful. He has got the Rift. Doesn't want to have to use it here, though. Taking a lot of damage. Chessy blinks in. He wants to toss back. He'll get it. But he's ruining place himself. Now, the ruin return. Boogie needs to escape. This is still alive. Chessy's almost dead. There's going to go down. Nightmare's going to be here for Boogie. Buys him a little bit of time. There's a going on. Echo Slam connects on a free. Morphling stands ground. When his curse comes out, they're trying to move away. But Morphling just stands. It doesn't actually attack for some reason. Jarek's going to get low. He might go down to Crepvice trying to keep him alive. But the Battle Hunger, it's going to tick him out. No way he survives this. The life drain is not available. Jarek's has a dieback. Mm, it's, it's hard, though. They still have another ward here. Yarrow, not gonna connect. connect. The Rue's Rue coming there. out. Fisher as well. They just want to force them away, which means that TFT knows it's getting low. When his curse is going to come out of the bug down, there's the horn in the back foot. Peck Zulu looks like he's going to go down. They're trying to backstab it. Thompson needs to finish this off quick because he's trying to go for it. The Avalanche is going to come out. No! He doesn't Mirana pick up the Aegis. Mirana gets it. And now Thompson's going to go down. They already lost his support. He'll lose his life as well. No Moody, bye -bye. running for the high heels. The call in the back foot will find more. But Timberman has no escape. The Rue's going to come out. He needs to turn around and run, but can he get out quick enough? The Avalanche Toss is going to be there. And Boogie, can he at least make an escape? Yes, he can, but he's not taking anyone alive with him. And now, Jarax, there is a sentry. Uh, they put a sentry down. The Fissure guess is wrong. They jump for Big he's coming up tiny. The call's going to be there, and Bexu's going to go down. That's a buyback on him, Topson. Chasing on a chessy, he might be out again. The BKBs don't matter to him. No, no, the missed shots. No. He's get it. He will use the adaptive strike to get it afterwards in the back, but they do lose Jarex though. Now Thompson has to fight up against Aaron. Winner's Curse is going to be there. Do they have the means to deal with him is the question. Paul's going to come out. They've got an arrow they can follow up with. He's got the satanic, but he hasn't triggered it. Thompson's going to go down. And they know he doesn't have buyback because he used it yep. about two minutes ago. It's a man being chased onto here. Aeon Disc will proc and he'll TP away, but the call's going to be there. Nope. Axe jumps in now, but Tumor Man has no escape. Fiend's Grip comes out on a Spectre. Pexy says go, run, but he can't. The Avalanche comes out. Pexy's been interrupted. They both die. There's the use of the Winner's Curse. Arrow. Arrow's going to connect and morph like Thompson has no escape. You can strength morph all you want, but this is living on a prayer. Maybe he gets away, turns into Tiny just to try and deal with the stats resistance, but you don't get that effect. And instead, Thompson's going to be ran down. Tries to make an escape, turns back into himself. Waveform. 
Can he get the safety? Is the question. Man, it does come out. He's been slow once again. Dodges it out by morphing back, though. And Jerak says, go. I will hold them back here. BKB being used by Axe. Paul's going to be there, but Thompson can't escape. No. They're going to move across. They'll be able to find him. That's but that is going to be the game. There is no way that they can hold now. Game one. TFT take game one. It's the gang potential later on, right? Like, Earth Spirit or Tiny can be looking for kills. Then you've got the Nimbus drop down. Yep. <laughs> That's what's going to break the smoke, though. He's just going to run, though. He's just going to run around. Dazzle yeah, power. Spark yeah, Grave's yeah. going to come out. Light Strike Grave's going to be there. And Dazzle will be the first blood as Thompson gets the kill. Unfortunately, he survives. And he's going to have the meta in 10 seconds. Jarax, though. Yeah, Jarax pretty deep. Light Strike Grave does connect on the Earth Spirit. Take a lot of damage. Jarax looks like Lena's going to be the one to go down first be rolling they hit to slow up on the pex who pex needs to move away They're trying to finish bottle to be able to find it we're just going to turn around the pex are in trouble the metamorphs has been used trying to slow them down the final hit is there boogie fine up against the terror blade he might get him again he just used the metamorphosis boogie moves Dazzle. towards Yakuchi. he should be able to get the two hits out but no oh. that's all rise in time and it will tick out so they're gonna get a rune piece in the bot lane new all top pex two is aggressive they'll get the kill onto the earth spirit now why needs to move away but can't lightning bolt's gonna be there chaser shows up ensures the kill light strike array can he actually get the deny on the rune no he cancelled his attack. It's too late. Chikuchi through by Boogie. Doesn't want to fight with Dazzle. And Jarex might go down here as they move forward. Light Strike Ray does come out. Turns around. Chessy has got the mana for another Lightning Bolt, though. There it is. Hits him once. Zaps him down. Double kill for Chessy. He'll turn around the back foot. Boogie does get the kill onto the Dazzle. He's been forced yeah. in the jungle early, and it slowed yeah, him down yeah. so much. He only just got his treads. Meanwhile, mid. Earth Spirit's been found. Tempest double. Tanking all the damage. And Earth Spirit's going to go down. The TP rotation in from Tiny. They're already ping it. He'll mm. cancel it. He realizes it's not a good idea. Chessy <laughs> on the back foot. Winner's curse cool comes stuff. out. There is no escape for this use. Light Strike Ray is there. Dragon Slave to get the kill. Yeah, the kill score is like 10 9. Tiny from oh, behind. Fly back from Zeus. Tiny just trying to backstab him, but Thompson healed up with the Cold Embrace. Going to be fine. They toss the tree across. Chessy hit up by the Light Strike Ray. Can't move in. Spark Rape's going to be here. Dragon Slave comes through. Tops on the back foot. Gets caught up. Funder goes Rafa. Going to be there. Get the Lino as well. They'll chase forward for more. They might be to fight, but they lost the Zeus in the meantime. He did buy back. Yeah, that's the dieback. But like uh, maybe Maelstrom and there's like, like anything to get active. Oh, Avalanche coming out. Sun's going to be there. Weaver, a little bit of trouble. Winner's Curse on point to protect him. Time lapse comes out. Boogie will make his escape. He is dusted up. But how do you catch him now? And Terrorblade, he did use the Metamorphosis for that. He'll jump in. Stun him up. Boogie needs to run. Should be able to escape. Light Strike Ray is going to be there. Earth Spirit turned around on it. He hasn't got an escape plan. He's going to go down on the side. Oh, the damage the is tiny. huge. Tiny with a double kill. Snipes out both supports. Chessy yeah, chasing thanks. forward to sides against Pursuing Fervor. Yeah, it, it's like Dragonlance four staff. It's it's a pike, and it's oh, great. But... Between four staff, they just use it to get close to the tops, and they sun them up. Let's move straight in. Down to half HP already. The thunder comes out, and he is going to fall. Terror blade. Is he going to go down? Blood's going to be there. He yeah. will die in response. But Thompson loses tempest double. Light strike ray is going to be there. Earth spirit goes down. Chase on the chessy. They might be able to find him as well. He has no escape plan from this. Four staffs come and cool down four seconds, but it won't matter. Only that. Only that ultimate orb, right? So we're not going to be able to split push as effectively. Smoke up coming out. Atos going to be used on the side. Avalanche backstab. They get the kill on the Pexu. Now, Earth Spirit hit up by the Laguna, but he heals too much. Shallow Grave just in case. Jarek will fall. Timbersaw trying to get involved. Time that's going to come up. Boogie needs to make his escape. The BKB is active for now. He won't be able to find the kill on the Earth Spirit, though. It'll be an escape. And now Zeus taking a lot of damage, but Boogie needs to retreat. Going to be slowed down a little bit by the Poison Touch, but of course, Shikuchi allows him to move fast. Lightning Bolt guesses wrong. And, well, it looked like Kriegis had the favorable location there. Trying to get on the oh, tiny now. This is a bold right. ass, though. He's a big tanky boy. Matuma man moving in. Shallow Grave's going to come out. Turn around. Avalanche. Silence going to be there. Pop the Aegis. Tiny. He should still fall. He gives up. No, he's going to go down. Thunder comes down. Matuma down, down to half HP. And now, Terrorblade looking to fight. Buyback's going to be there on Tiny. TPing in right now. That's... Terrorblade. Jump straight in. Needs to be careful. Move away. He's trying to cut them out. The stun will miss. And TB will fall. They buy back for him. Avalanche tosses the back foot. They finally kill the Weaver. The time lapse comes out. They can't get him in time. They do at least get the Arc Warden, though. It's tiny kill, actually. It's hard, but he might. Uh, Hex comes out, and for some reason, he doesn't look like a piggy. But status resistance won't save him. Shallow Grave will. It's going to be there. They should be able to keep him alive. Spark Grave's going to come out, and it won't go on to him. Meanwhile, Zeus does get picked off in the top lane. Yeah, Hung around a little bit too great. long. But they might find Topson. He's going to go for the TP. It's going to be close. He can't get out. But Tumba Man, trying to look for his opportunity. Yule's going to be there on Earth Spirit. When he comes down, he's in a lot of trouble. Going to move across. Shallow Grave's going to come out, and now Matuma Man. He needs an escape plan because he might be melee full, but Terrorblade hits pretty damn hard. He'll get the kill on the Earth Spirit. Now he needs to retreat. Atos going to come Buy out. Avalanche going to be there. Buy back on the Earth Spirit, but Tiny's here to make sure the cleanup happens. But the Winning Curse comes out. Now after the Thunder, he'll move on. Terrorblade <laughs> just tagging his own teammate. Timbersaw can try and turn around. Gets down to half HP. Light Strike Ray is going to be there to clean him up. 
He's gone. Now Jarak's gonna run for the high heels because Tiny is here and he does hit hard. He just wants to hit him in the face with a little stomp. Atos is gonna be there tossing the air. Jarak's staying alive with Glimmer Cape. Cold Embrace is gonna come out. He's gonna live. On the side, Pexy will fall and Matumba Man. He buys so much time. His whole team arrives and now Tiny stunned up trying to run away. Shallow Grave's gonna come out once more. Tosses them away. Needs to escape to safety, but Timothy Ford, he might not make it out. Oh, Chakra Fruit you. gets like, it. Our opponent is taking your retriever. He's taking your sides. They are in the so base. They're just lane. seizing. It yeah. looks like it is going to be done here. It's, uh, it's going to be close. They need to move right now. You take right your now. Arc here, yo. You take your Arc There's no buyback. Tops moves in. Hex comes out and dazzles. Final goes for Afi and use. But Timber Man is trying to fight up against his BKB. He's going to be activated. Terrorblade. He can't gain fast enough on the side, though. They're just hitting the builds. Boogie's going to get low. BKB was activated because the Nimbus is the Illusion might go down. Kevin Star Wars going to fall alongside him. Laguna on the side. They finally kill the Zeus to come back in. But Timberman fuels it up. Stands ground. Winners is going to be there. And Tiny's going to go down. GG cool. Maybe they held there, but let's be totally honest. After they hold, what was the plan? Boogie going to be that off lane. Brew with Matumba, the, the Ursa. The Timberman has to back off. He knows he can't get that kill. Yeah, he wants off. Boots, no, no. A lot of damage being done. Oh, oh my god. Boogie just evaporates. The way I look at that. Actually, they might just another game in. Toss across. Not. Going on a Venom So They clap him up. Gale does no connect. No mana to work with. He's only got one stick charge. It's not enough. The overpower is too expensive these days. Avalanche is going to come out, though. They bring down the CM. Need one more tap. Ursa should find it. He'll get the kill. I can tell you, no one's really jungling at the moment. Oh. Toss on the Undying back towards the Ancient here. That's uh, it's optimistic. But they'll move across. The clap can now be there. They might be able to now find it. Undying going to get low. Alpha to slow down the Brewmaster. They'll slow him down with the Drunken Haze. Toss up on the spot. Tiny, can he get the foul tap? Okay. Nope, Pexu does. Crystal Nova comes out. Light Strike Ray will not connect on the Tiny. Brew. Oh, moving forward here. Venomanta, if he tries to get his hands on this rune, he can easily die. Tiny's pretty deep, though. He wanted a rune as well. He has got the Avalanche. Pap's going to come out. Split as well, chasing on a Chessie. No one's taking the rune just yet, and actually Tiny ignores it. Nigma sneaks in to take it. There's going to be a Cyclone coming out. Spark Ray's oh, down. Yours being used. Lena. In a little bit of trouble, tossed on the spot and gone. Black Hole does come out, hits under the Bruce split and the Tiny on the side. Thompson doesn't even care about the zombies right zombies, now. He's going to fight back. Tiny should be going down. It's a two for two trade so far. Now they're going to jump in. Undying using the ultimate. But they can't find an additional target. Ursa's is going to try and walk this one off. He slowed up a little bit. They haven't got the mana for Gale though. Rage has been used. Ursa just trying to make his escape, but no one is helping him. They'll move forward. Rave Fire Blast comes out. Ursa the Blink Dagger on the Rave King. Yeah, oh, speaking of daggers, <laughs> blink in from Rafe can go on a peck here, frost bitten up. No He's mana. got the rear mana for the reincarnate. No, we can't get it in time. It's going to go down. No, the stop. poison never comes out, but it won't matter. Peck two done is the heart. Venomart's going to look to four stuff away. Going to be chased on two anyway. Undying. Cut off on the side. Ursa wants some vengeance here. And he should be able to find out the final tap will come out. Venomart's might be able to escape in the meantime. <laughs> Wait, no. Nice. What? Undying stuck in a kill on a peck two here. And actually, Ursa, he might be going down. He's going to die off to the Veno. <laughs> Perfect answer, you kill. He'll find it. Toss in. Jesse does use the Yules. And there is Avalanche through the final kill on the Lena. Nigma will look to just back off. He's this close to Blink. He doesn't want to die. They will clean up his little babies as the Eidolon's yeah. full. And now into the pit goes That's Ursa. Right. Should have probably should have probably Yuled the Ursa there. Oh, wait, they side. found Enigma as well. He's got the black hole, but no opportunity to use it. It's just going to fall. And that is an easy Roche opportunity now. <laughs> I definitely shouldn't have went there. Uh, the tiny might be baiting this. Yeah. Oh, oh, toss oh. in. Poison Nova comes out on a Pexu, though. Nice four stuff away to get out of the spark, Rafe. And it looks like Pexu's going to fall, but the Poison Nova's been used. Now Ursa, forced to fight here, needs to move away. Now the split coming out. Rafe Fire Blast, not on time. Rafe King in trouble. The buyback's going to come on Pexu. Looks like Undyne's going to fall. And surrounded Rafe King, he might have the mana for a reincarnate, but what can you do with it when you come back up? The answer is nada. The stun up on Pexy, but it won't matter. Avalanche comes out, Freezing Bill's been used, and he has gone for the second time. Yeah, that was really desperate. You can do so much work here. Oh, Enigma's fine. Blinks away in time, but Venomarts might not be. The split's gonna come out, tries to force stuff away, but maybe it's too late. In the meantime, it looks like they'll get killed down dying, but Venom knows what comes next. He's got level two poison over, but how do you follow up? Topson has been gailed. Yep, he has been disarmed as well. He's gonna look to move away. They'll turn around. Ursa shows up. Venomarts goes down. Cyclone does connect on the Wraith King. He's been found as well. And the stakes, mate, they wanted to try and reset and get a good black hole. They won't be able to anymore because they don't have the damage to follow it up. Wraith King will go down once. Oh, eventually. Oh. And he might go down oh. a second time. He's trying for the armlet. Oh, is he going to live? The urn's on him, though. Toss in the air. He wouldn't be able to blink Final. away. He'll go down once. They got the avalanche coming off cooldown. Nope. 
He actually looks to fight. He's going to turn around to Ursa here. They have got the black oh, hole thrown out the two. They'll get Ursa to turn around the tiny as well. Pegs, you can't get across in time to help. Frostbite goes out. The Rave King trying to move away. Freeze Mule comes down. Rave Fire Blast thrown out. Crystal Maiden in a lot of trouble. Rave King going to stand and fight his ground. Crystal Maiden, one more tap will do it. The kid gets her. And now, Brewmaster, he can't decide which one he wants to try and kill because he's getting caught perfectly here. Thompson does it right now. They jump in the Rave Fire Blast. But the Magnet Field goes down. Light Strike Ray is going to be there. But Rave King, he's getting super low. Soul Rip to keep him alive with the arm that he might stay. And this Thompson's going to fall. Chesky with the BKB doing a lot, but not enough. He's still going to go down. And Undying will turn around the Soul Rip. Thompson's Tempest double. Can he get the kill on Undying? Yes, it can. It's going to be everyone dying on both sides in the end. As the only man left alive is the Venom answer after the fact. TFT there was they knew that the Fin stack had to come by them to get to the Roche Pit. And now they're going to jump in. They're going straight to work. Lena, she's gone. Now the split's going to be out as well. Look at more. Rave King taking a lot of damage. The buyback stay on the Undying. The poison on the side. Only hitting on the Pegsu. And actually, Venom answer versus Crystal Maiden. And Venom is forced to run. In the meantime, Rave King left alone here. They got the Black Hole, but they have no way of using it. Brewmaster on point with the zoning out. Enigma can't get in. And the Hex stop Piggy. It looks like he's going to fall. Rave King goes down for the second time. Split will end. Trying to move in. Avalanche going to be there. And Enigma, they jump in. The blink fall from the Brewmaster. Does he get the kill on Tiny? No. He doesn't even get him. Ernst going to be there now. But Undying gives his life for this. That's a dieback. Brief time, actually. At least it will a pitiful Venom answer with a little bit of help. Oh, split. Jump in. Black Hole comes out. Just on the one. Just the Thompson alone. They'll be able to get him. But now, going to work. But Tumor Man, can you do enough here? Chessy going to retreat with the BKB. Still running. Rave King's going to go down once. Like, Strike Ray is going to be on the Pexy. But now, you need to run. Chessy can't hang around too long. They have still got the Aegis, but they're going to turn around and fight more Tiny. Trying to force up Avalanche. Toss across. He'll take Alina with it. He does go down now the movement forward. Ursa might be forced to fight here. He does have the Aegis. He should look to, in fact. But three on one. He doesn't want to do it. Buyback comes out from tops, and now they're in full retreat. They need to actually escape this. The Hex comes out. Rave King protected by the Glimmer Gate, but the Dust does reveal him. Now, Spark Race is going to move forward. The Aegis did go pop, but with that, so is Rave King. He's down. 85 seconds on the sideline. He'll be forced to buyback straight away. But guess what? Chessie does not have a buyback for 60 seconds. Yeah, that's really good. That's really good that he bought back. Especially if they manage to take the racks. Oh, they'll jump forward. Looking at Pexy, though. He'll just disappear in three hits. Take a four. Turn around. Jump in. Undyne's going to go down. Buyback comes out from CM. Trying to move in. And Nick with a black hole. Just on the top. Gets interrupted, though, by the root. No. He can't get him quick enough. Down trying to move away. Poison is not going to be the Laguna as well. Top is going to get low. If they can get him, they can win this. They're going to move forward again. And they clean him up. 125 seconds dead. They'll get rid of the Tempest double. And there's been nothing in response that they've found. You can actually just go straight into the base. Take multiple lanes. In the meantime, they do get come to Undying. But that's not good enough. Uh, sir, they're going to turn around. He's too far forward. Light Strike Ray is going to come out. And he's going to go down as well. Midnight Pulse is there. He can't get out of it. He's going to fall. He does have buyback. He's going to have to use no, they know he has no buyback, 100%. So they're going to take all three sides by the time he's alive. It, it, it's going to be interesting to see if they decide to go back or not after this. Nope, 40 seconds. They, Screw it. Why? Why would him. you? This is the perfect opportunity. This golden exactly. opportunity. Probably the best There's opportunity to get on game. BKB comes out. If it's going to be there, Lena, a little bit troll forced up the way. This is going to be used, but no, she's fine. She has still got the BKB, but they're jumping in. They're going to do this. But no, can he move away quick enough? Looks like he can because Ursa slowed up. He can't actually move forward. He has to eat the cheese, but he's still waiting here on the right click to Ray Fire Blast. Comes out, Light Strike Ray, look at me. He's gone. Game. No game. chance of coming back from that 120 seconds dead. All right, moving in. BKB comes out of Chessie. They might turn around, look at the Brewmaster. They decide against it, though. They just want to retreat. They're happy with Megas for now. Oh, jump in. Avalanche comes out. Tiny looking to toss him back and be able to do so. Wrong way, in fact. <laughs> Rave King's fine. Yeah. They're forced off him. Enigma right now, he's outside the base the whole time. The Shadow Blade, he needs to make his move soon. There you go, BKB yeah, jumps in black. Oh, there it is. Pops has been found. Hung and cornered. He's got no escape. And with that death, it looks like TFT will be the victors here. They don't have to leave. They're just buying a little bit of time as Brewmaster's BKB runs out and he falls. He'll buy back, but it's too late. He's going to lose Tiny as well. And it looks like it's over. TI winners cannot win the best of three. In the end, TFT emerge victorious here. They go for one last hurrah, but Brewmaster knows. He's just going to be kited to the ends of the earth. Light Strike Ray comes out. Four stab away. Ray Fire Blast says Blitz has been used. But now you're in a five on... I'll, take, I'll give you the advantage here. Four scenario. But Brewmaster, he can't really do enough. And it's going to get low. Being kited still. Brave King has to reincarnate once more. Midnight Pulse will go down. And it looks like it's all coming to an end. The poor little Earth panel will try and run off. But the Mega Creeps are here. And with that, it should be an empty jump in. Oh, it goes to work. It's looking for it. Lena goes down. Buyback comes out on the straight away. Rave King's going to stand his ground. He has got the reincarnate. We'll be able to slow them down a little bit. Rave Fire Blast stuns up the Brewmaster and the Tiny. Oh, trying to move forward. BKB is going to run out soon. Four stuff away. There's the Shivas. They stun him up. They turn around. He's gone. The last hopes. The tears in their eyes. As they'll have to wait until later this month to give it another try. TFT. They go through.